Hey everyone, Katherine King here, and today I'm gonna to go through my Scentsy Club order. So this club is only my monthly, and my monthly club is the one that changes all the time. Every month things are different because it's what, you know, let's say a scent's coming out, so I'm gonna throw it in club, uh, you know, and, and get one, see if I wanna keep it, that kind of thing. And that is exactly what I did in this. I kept changing it up, but it came in the weirdest box. Isn't that weird? Yes, there's my whiff box, but look, it's like a flat long one. So I've never had that before. So that was new. <clears throat> we'll go through the whiff box last, just in case you don't want spoilers, but um, I'd be surprised if you haven't seen spoilers by now. Okay, so the scent of the month for this month is pink leather. So I picked up two. So what I'm gonna start doing is having the scent of the month and um, scent circles every single month. I just figured that'd be kind of fun to do that. So pink leather, which I have not smelled yet. Um, I picked up a Shoreline Drive-In Pod. It's so good. I warmed some the other day in the bathroom or something. I was like, I really like that. So let's throw it in some, oops, throw it in some pods. It's really good. I like it. All right. I haven't really tried their bath gels, so I thought, well, I'll go ahead and order some bath gels. So the first one is coconut daiquiri, coconut milk, banana, and vanilla cream. So try that one. And then I did want to try the one in Just Breathe, which is eucalyptus, lemon, and mint. I thought those would be fun to try out. We have our handy dandy bag here. I'm gonna try and open it down here. I think it only got to 100 today. So not bad. Yep, this is sopping wet. So they've gone back to definitely not putting these in bags. Because unfortunately doing that makes the bars wet. The inside of the bag's wet. I don't know why they're doing things that way. All right, so let's just go ahead and go through through the only one that I've smelled before is Pacific Mist. This is June's scent of the month, I believe. Very, very good. I thought that would make a great bathroom scent. All right, scent of the month, pink leather. Let's see. Okay, you know what? That's not bad. I was really worried about the leather note in it. It actually is very nice. And I can see if you've been, if you've been seeing the reviews on this, people have been saying that it smells like uh, pink, you know, sugar, sugar berry mint. And it definitely does. All right, I'm gonna pick up a few more of those. All right, this one I haven't tried either. It's the Haunted Mansion Three Thumbs Up. Because people say it smells like bread, so it got me intrigued. Just smells kind of cinnamony to me. But I can see where you're getting the, the dough, the yeasty dough note. Yeah, no, I can see where you get that. For me, I think it's the one bar is enough, but I can see why people like it. And then the controversial scent right now is Friends. My club ships on the 8th. This came out on the 7th, or it processes the 8th. So um, I've heard reviews that this is definitely not a coffee scent, so. And Brandy was 100% right. AJ. AJ. There he is. No, there's no coffee in this. This is coconut. It's a nice coconut scent. I, I'll, I'll give them that. It is a great coconut scent. It is not a coffee scent. Not in the least. But I will warm it and I'll let you guys know what my opinion is. But it is not coffee. This is coconut. Kind of a letdown. Um, let's get this out here. Because, I mean, it's like once, once again... Since he can't seem to make a good coffee and you know there are vendors that can 
So if you don't mind buying vendor wax for certain things, I would go to the vendor wax world for your coffee. And I can point you in the right direction. So um, anyway, let's go through the whiff box. I do know what's in it. So let's see. Well, here's the bag, so we'll just set that out. Um, here is the card that's in it. Look at, uh, look forward to a new season. So, um, I have found in the past, I keep a spreadsheet of, you know, all the LTO, everything basically for Sensi. And it seems like this month is always the sampler month for the upcoming scents. So that's always really fun. It's a great box to get. So these are going to be new scents. So the first one, it, well, this one's on. All right, Scentsy Fresh in Fluffy Fleece. We have not had fresh in the Fluffy Fleece before, so uh, we'll see. Um, I'm not keen on the wax, but you know, we'll see. In laundry, it's hella strong. This is why it's such a heavy box, all these big things. All right, next one is Scarlet Sunflower in, in the counter clean. Now, Scarlet Sunflower is okay. So these are old scents, um, but these are what's coming out in the new catalog. So it's a sampler of the upcoming catalog. Um, I like, you know, Sunflower or Scarlet Sunflower a little, but for me, it is a headache inducer. So it is what it is. Okay, so let me close up this box here so I don't get squiggles everywhere. All right, and this is Glacier Water. You know, this is one frustrating thing with Sensi. So this was the scent of the month last year, right? It was August scent of the month. Um, and now it's in the catalog, but they don't put the scent notes on. Sensi really needs to put like, if Counter Clean is coming this, that page should list the scent notes. So no one, if they haven't smelled Glacier Water, has no idea what's in it because there's no scent notes in the catalog. I think that's a bit frustrating. Well, it is for me. I mean, I know the scent. I liked it. I clubbed it for a bit. But I want to know what it smells like in body. I don't think there's a pull thing. Oh, maybe there is. Well, I'm glad they seal it because it's kind of ooey gooey. Well, it's now all over my hands. It's just really ooey gooey in here. But anyway, yeah, smells really, really good. So now that my hands smell like glacier water, good thing I'm taking a shower right after this, right? We'll try it out. All right, my next one. Get the bars out. All right, so Fall Into Love. This is one of the new scents coming in. Now, as you know, I didn't order the six new bars. I'm gonna wait till I can bundle and save them instead of paying the full price that consultants have to pay if they get it early. This is like stuck. There it goes. It is really good. It's a tree. A tree scent with with other stuff obviously I didn't look it up oh all right let's see fall into love oh that might be from harvest Yeah, that's gotta be from Harvest. Sorry about that. Um, but anyway, it's really good. It is a tree scent though. And then the scent of the month for September, they gave us another full bar of it. I, I hope they continue this trend. This is fantastic. I love it. Um, I did order the um, scent of the month kit, which consultants can get. It orders on the 15th. Um, it's an auto ship should you choose. I got it based on Brett and Brad's recommendation of the scent. So let's see what I think. 
it's kind of light. It is kind of light, but it definitely smells like a cinnamon roll with the drizzle, not the cream cheese, just the powdered sugar drizzle. That does smell very good. I'm excited about that. So maybe I'll, maybe I'll warm this tomorrow. I've got this and this for sure to take to work. And I really want to try out the pink leather. So all these great new scents. For me, this was a great club order. I got these, you know, I could take or leave, honestly, um, just because I have so many already. Um, I mean, just accumulating and, and everything. But uh, uh, I'm excited about the shower gels, the new scents. I, I'm gonna try and see if this has a hint of coffee in it. Um, if not, we'll see if I like it as a really good coconut scent. So that's what I have for you guys. Thanks for hanging out with me for just a few minutes and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.